So what is tall, dark, and handsome and loves a good runway walk? I know you're going to. You? No, it's <laughs> not me, but I, I can't believe that you thought so. It's the annual Misters for MS Benefit, and it's back after going virtual last year due to the pandemic. And joining us now with details of this year's much-anticipated event, it's coming up this Saturday. Yep. Deborah Eichenberger is the executive director. Hey there, Deborah. So great to catch up with you on this. Good morning, and I don't know if you knew, but we already had you signed up for the runway this week. I hope that you're okay with that. <laughs> Are you okay with that, Eric? I will pull out my <laughs> shoes and some... Are you stretching already for your runway walk? Is well, that you, what you're doing? You don't want to get a cramp. You don't want to get a cramp on the runway. They're not going to be talking about me. Deborah, don't tease him like that. He will be there <laughs> right at the edge of the runway. Well, Deborah, well I was going to say, we can get UPS involved, too. It sounded like they had a lot of people that might be available to hop on the runway next year. Deborah, I love the way you're working right? this. Right? She is. <laughs> Deborah, for people that maybe are not so familiar with the Misters for uh, MS Benefit, uh, what is it and what do you raise money for? Well, thank you so much for asking. You know, the first preconception that we normally have when we have a runway style event with gentlemen is that a lot of people think that our misters are actually up for, um, you know, bids themselves that you could take a gentleman on a date, which is exactly what our event is not. Um, <laughs> uh, like you said, we have a tall, dark and handsome fundraiser, but what our gentlemen actually do on the stage is to get on the stage, they have to be the top 10 fundraisers of all of the gentlemen that are nominated every year. And then once they are able to get onto the runway, they actually help us auction off our live auction items. So, um, you know, prior to that at the event, we have a silent auction, we have a wine pool with an opportunity to win an entire case of very, very good wine. We also have a bourbon pool with a bottle of Pappy inside, um, and then cocktails, tons of food, and then um, after all that, our gentlemen get up and strut their stuff. <laughs> hey, we mentioned uh, this event was virtual last year. What's the excitement level being back in person this weekend? We have seen a lot of our National MS Society events selling out this year. We know that people are ready to get back to our normal. I will say that our event in particular has a lot of safety protocols in place. So if you're nervous about coming out, um, tickets are still for sale. And we will make sure that you have a very good but very safe time. And Deborah, MS affects people in so many different ways, right? It, it's just, it's difficult. I, mean, I talked to you uh, yesterday or the day before just about how it affected my family and, and my aunt personally. Why is it so important to support this event and, and what is the money going towards? Absolutely. So the National MS Society just did some new research a couple of years ago and learned that um, nearly double the amount of people than we previously thought are living with MS in the United States. So most of our money does go to research, advocacy, and education because our, our number one goal at the National MS Society is to cure MS. And we talked briefly about this last week, but there's two types of MS. One type is well, there's actually three types, but the two most common types are um, relaxing remitting. That's where your symptoms can come and go. Come and, go. and then there's a more uh, progressive style of MS where um, you do see a rapid change in function over time. And we just had a volunteer explain it um, really well. Your uh, myelin is what covers your nerves. This is about to get kind of nerdy here, but your myelin is what covers your nerves and, and um, keeps everything in line with your body. And when you start to have lesions from MS, that myelin sheath goes away. And what I always explain it as is, everyone can relate to this, your, your iPhone cord. At the very end where you plug in the USB, you know how it always frays right there and you feel like you've only had it for about a week before it starts to do that? That's similar to what the myelin sheath around the nerves looks like. So once those become exposed, you can start having further symptoms around um, mobility, you can have um, issues with your speech, you can have vision loss, um, and you know numbness and tingling and everything else that would go into that. So this is a disease that affects, affects a lot of people, and so we need you to come out and help us find a cure, raise that dollar. Such good work that uh, that's being done around this. Deborah, thank you very much. Uh, and WHAS is a proud sponsor of the 2021 Mr. for MS Benefit. It is again this Saturday starting at 630 at the Louisville Marriott downtown. And you can find tickets and more information by visiving Mr's for MS dot